Speaking of dating, uh, YouTuber Sharon Seven took to social media to speak about dating unattractive men. Take a look. So you find a provider, but he ugly. I'm embarrassed to be seen in public with him. I'd be embarrassed to be seen in public at work. Sprinkle, sprinkle. I would walk into any place with an ugly old man any day than walk into a job and clock in and say, yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. And I'm sorry I'm late. And can I take tomorrow off? I'm sorry. I'd rather walk into the ugliest dude ever. They have to do all of that. Sprinkle, sprinkle. <laughs> would you seriously date guys you weren't attracted to? If that means you were taking care of financially, you know where I'm going first. Al Reynolds, what do you think about this? <laughs> Listen, you know, I have 100 jobs. So I, to be taken care of financially, no, I, I, I feel like, and this is what my comment was going to be. What are we doing, ladies? Like, what is really going on? Why would you ever want to rely 110% on a man financially that's just not smart what happened to the days of women chasing their careers now if you got a career and still meet a very wealthy man who's not attractive would i date him heck yeah i don't i don't looks aren't that important to me things at this age for me that are important is stability both emotionally mentally um, someone who's got good credit, someone who's got a decent job, someone who's healthy. You know, I the looks the looks aren't that important to me. And the more money you got, the uglier you can be. Mm. Mm. I'm on you go before I. Um, I'll just say this. Sometimes like this, it, it makes me glad I'm gay because child, I, she seems she sound lazy. She don't want to work. You know, right. and I need you to work. Like I, I can't. With that, because, you know, as ugly as that fool might be, he's still going to want some head. And, you know, oh. you're going to have to put your pride to the side and do what do what you got to do. And I just couldn't possibly do that at the end of the well, day. Well, you ain't got to look at his face when you're giving him Yeah, head. but they're going to be wanting to kiss and take you out and hold you. <laughs> you know, when they real ugly like that and they got the bag, they want people to know that they got somebody. So you're going to have to really show out in public. You know what I mean? So I just don't feel like I can stomach that kind of energy. However, on the flip side, though, I I like a, like an average look, like for a relationship. Now, if I'm just doing a hookup kind of vibe, you can be above average. But like, if I'm doing a relationship or if you got like money, like you can just be average to medium because that's when you're going to be really committed to me. You're going to probably treat me right. The right. ones that's super fine and all that, like, it's a lot of drama. They're going to be cheaters. They're going to be hoes. You're not going to be happy. So give me somebody average with good credit, financial stability. You know what I mean? And and, and treats me right and, and grows with me. And I'm happy. So wait a minute, Armand. So what, where do you land on that spectrum? I feel like I'm average. Oh, okay. All right. I cannot be modest tonight. Mm, I feel like I am. <laughs> I cannot do ugly. I will not do ugly. I will do single, lonely, and broke before I do ugly. I'm not really? going to be with no, yes, I'm not going to be with no good animal because you make life a little bit easier when I know I'm able-bodied and I can go work. I don't want something unattractive. I don't want something looking like a puffer fish in my bed looking at me all, what are we doing? But what if his no. body was nice and no. he had, and his family come from good family, good stock. He just didn't win the face card. What if everything else was cool? No. He made you no. laugh. No. Well, it depends on what's ugly, because if no. the face is just not proportioned right, I can get with that. But if the teeth are a mess, it's a no. <laughs> I like a man that takes care of his teeth. I like a man that takes care of his body. I like a man that knows how to communicate. I like a man that pays attention. And I like fine men. I mm. like attractive men. And guess what? It is possible, because I've had quite a few baddies in my life. Okay, I don't do ugly men. I do not do ugly men because I don't have to do ugly men. I like oh. fine, successful, and body. And guess what? The trifecta is out there. Talented, fine, and sexy. They all exist out there. But Trust they me. cheat and lie. Some they of sure them do, do and some all of them the don't. You gotta catch cheat them. and lie. Ugly men cheat too. Look at Simon. <laughs> this, you know what? Dang. He rich though. He rich. That's why. Hi. Well, yeah. Okay. Is he? How? Oh, okay. I see where you're going with you Well, he's got good teeth. <laughs> I, oh, he bought those. Okay. Yeah, he does. He has good teeth now. But I'm just saying, ugly men cheat too. And I'm not to single out him, but there's unattractive men that cheat too. But I know a lot of women, they kind of like their, especially like really pretty girls. I feel like women kind of like their men to be a little bit ugly because yeah. they're not competing in the bathroom. You know what That's I mean? True. So they get to feel like the prize. You know, a when lot. your man is too attractive, Women don't really like that because they don't get to feel like the pretty one. 
I you get right, that a lot. That's definitely <laughs> what you say. I, I said you. I get that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's definitely a thing. Like, you, as long as you're, I ain't nothing sexier than a man that's fine that doesn't tell you he's fine. Like, that's when I, we mm. were talking about that whole catch oh, thing. That ain't gonna work. That for makes me. you want to jump all <laughs> over you when you are just like attractive and you're not even like reminding me of it. Like, you gonna get a whole bunch from me behaving like that, being fine and humble. I know I'm asking for a unicorn right here, but there's a couple unicorns out there. Out there.